so first question <coughs> sorry examine the potential sorry patterns and morphology of rural settlements in india so patterns and morphology of rural settlements in india so 15 marks refer the uh, domestication of plants and in, uh, and establishment of settlements the human beings were normal wandering in tribes across the landscapes in recent in research in 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 search food and water before domestication of plants establishment of rural settlements of settlements uh, the human beings were normal or, or, or nomads or wandering in tribes across the landscape in uh, in search food and water various historians and cultural and anthropologists were uh, anthropologists anthropologists gave reasons for the establishment have been religious cultural political and economics six types of rural, uh, rural uh, six time six types of rural settlements that is rectangular rectangular patterns it mainly develop in productive alluvial plants plains in rectangular patterns it mainly develop in productive alluvial plants and wide in uh, intermediate intermontmonet valleys the lanes are almost straight meeting each other at the right angle linear pattern so rectangular you can see it may mainly developed develop in productive alluvial plains and white in uh, intermediate intermediate valleys and the, the lanes are almost straight meeting each other at right angle so linear patterns houses are arranged along either side uh, either side of the road railway line and river or canal linear settlements in the so linear settlement in the hill areas is largely controlled by terrain and topography so then circular and semi circular pattern so it is found mainly along so the coastal crater oxbow lakes etc they are highly they are highly depend on they are highly depend on blue economy so circular and semi circular pattern it is found mainly along the coast crater oxbow lakes take uh, Ox oxbow lakes etc they are highly de depend on blue economy and marine resources catching fish water nuts etc star like star like pattern so it is develop mainly where several metal and unmetal roads coverage so star like patterns you can see metal and unmetal roads develop so many of their coverage you can see and Punjab province particular you can see and Satluj Jamuna plains there you can see so you can see uh, star like patterns and circular and others semi circular semicircular village of the North Delhi river it is next triangular it generally developed near the confluence of river and the nebular pattern the size of nebular settlements is small and they develop around the house of the main landlord muscle temple or church it is nebular pattern 
So last stage, so you can see, so morphology of rural settlements, it deals with layout, plane or internal structure of the settlement. It not only covers physical sphere, but also covers socio-economic space. The morphology of settlements has two main components, ground plane and build, build up area. So ground plane, which includes build, uh, a building state patterns uh, and arrangements of buildings and cultural artifacts artifact, like temple, mosque, etc. church and build up area it is mainly homogeneous so like uh, grazing land, village roads or street, temple, school, village infra infrastructure the main sites of central uh, location inhabited by early village so so you can see in the nucleus uh, family okay so you can see in small hamlets like village and are locally named after lower or dominant caste residing there tolo pura patti caste and they are the build up area forming the nucleus of the settlements attract the maximum concentration of socio-economic activities so build up area you can see socio-economic activities high and transport movement high so now we discuss all the things so thank you